Wake up. What's going on, Nick? You passed out. Man. Man. Where are we? We're about 20 miles north of Alpha Unit. If they're still alive. Why do you have to talk that way, Nick? What happened? You don't remember, do you, Tommy? We lost all our unit in Area 5, except for you and me. I guess we're lucky. I found this place. We're on our own. There's no way out. We're probably gonna die. And we're out of cigarettes. Why do you have to be that way, Nick? Maybe we can get out. How do you know what out of smokes? Maybe I got some. Trust me. I know. Stash. Been saving those for weeks and you stole them. Nick. Nick, I gotta get out of here, man. I'm scared. Hey, we're safe here. Bullshit. We can't see anything in here. For all we know, we're surrounded and they're gonna blow us away. Give up opposition now and we're dead. I'm not ready to go just yet. If you try and leave, I'll kill you myself. Sit your ass back down, soldier. Did you hear that? I didn't hear nothing. You miss home, Nick? I wonder what my wife's doing right now. I know what she's doing. What? What is she doing, Nick? How long have you been gone, Tommy? A year and a half. Eighteen months. You think because you count the months it's less time? Come on, Tommy, wake up. Your wife's not waiting for you to come home and satisfy her. Probably already found somebody new. You're out here playing with yourself, and your wife's getting fucked by another guy. <laughs> Fuck you, Nick. Fuck you! You're jealous because I have a wife back home and you don't. She sends me letters and packages. You don't get shit, Nick. You don't get shit. I can have any woman I want. I just pick. Must be tough picking between all those farm animals. Which is better, Nick? A horse or a sheep? <laughs> Nick, I guess you forgot to pick which ones we're supposed to write because I haven't seen you get one letter since I've been here. <laughs> I think I would show you my letters. <laughs> I've got many, but they're private. <laughs> How long have you been here, Nick? 30 months? Two and a half years, Tommy. And I'm not afraid to say it. Years. Speaking of letters and packages, when's the last time you got anything from your wife? What's her name? Janet. Janet. It's been a while. Happy birthday to you. Happy 
birthday to you. Happy birthday to Tommy. Happy birthday. Fuck you. One year next week. That's a long time, Tommy. A long time. Did you ever write Janet about that night when you were on point? Hey, shut up, man. I promise you never bring that up again, remember? Don't worry, Tommy. As long as you're good, I can't remember what happened. How about you sending stuff? Ever since we've been on this mission, we've been on the move. What mission? Our search and destroy mission? Are you really that fucking stupid? How long have we been on this mission? About six months. Half a year. Six months? Half a year, damn it. And what have we accomplished since this mission began? Well, we secured areas, took prisoners, eliminated the enemy. That's not what I'm talking about, Tommy. I'm asking you, what did we accomplish? Do you get the feeling you're already dead? No. We just have to take control. As soon as more support comes, we'll take control of what? Come on. Are we in the same war? I've been here two and a half years, Tommy. And there is no more support. They don't care about us, man. Don't you get it? We've been sacrificed. I wonder why we're here. No wonder we're losing this war. Don't you listen? Come on, Nick. That shit. Remember Frontier 7? That was different. That's what they want you to believe. It's always different. Until you get here. It's the same bullshit. This is a fucking business. I can't believe you were enlisted before the war started. I didn't have any money. I came to the military for a career. And I got one. I get paid to kill people. You're sick, man. You know that? All this time, you still don't understand. Understand what? Forget it. Understand what? It's not important. You think you know everything, honey? Huh, I don't know shit, but I'm smart enough to figure out when you send me home in body bags every day for two and a half years. You sure as shit ain't winning the goddamn war. So guess what, Tommy? We must be losing. I think you want to die. What did you say, honey? You heard me. Talk to me, Mr. Point. You said you weren't going to bring that up again. I changed my mind. Let's talk about that night, Tommy. Don't do it, I remember Nick, it was please. real cold. It was raining. We were deep into their territory. Come on, stop. You were so please. fucking wasted that night. You could barely walk, much less be a lookout. Please don't talk about it anymore, Nick. We were ambushed while you were passed out in the mud. We lost ten men. Wasn't it ironic that you were still alive? I guess the enemy figured with a point man like you. They should just keep them alive so next time they could just walk right in and slit our fucking throats again. <laughs> Remember that night, you bastard? Ever put that in one of your letters to Janet? <laughs> God. No way. 
No fucking way, Nick. I'm not dying in this hole. You hear me? I'm getting out. You're not going anywhere. I'm in charge now, and I'm ordering you to stay put. Let's go. If we stay here, I know we're gonna die. I can't let you go out there now, Tommy. If you do, they'll spot you in the daylight and kill you. And then me. I'm leaving. Don't. Or I'll kill you. I'm out of here. Tommy! I hope you make it. I need their vitals back. Pressure's coming down on both, but there's irregularities in special functions. That's new. We better postpone exercise C until we know what that means. We're too close to stop now. Give them S5 and bring them down faster. Change variable eight to three. I want them ready by 0600 to do it again. These doctors studied us hoping to learn something from having us play out our nightmares. Unfortunately, they were missing the point. We were created by war, and more like us would be too. It's difficult to comprehend how we could take so many lives without remorse. I've tried explaining it, and all I come up with is sinking. No matter who you are, you sink to the bottom. A place where nothing else matters but that moment. Tommy and I can never leave that place. Every morning we're back there, trying to survive. I realize now, the power to heal lies within, and with each day, I struggle to face myself a little more. I just want to come alive again. 